Hi, and welcome to Discover Hope. We are so glad that you're here. And if you are searching for hope, then you have come to the right place. My name's Pat, and I'd love to share something called the three circles with you today. The first circle is brokenness. The world is broken. You've probably figured that out for yourself already. There's war, disease, violence, so much suffering, anxiety, depression, and addiction. But that wasn't God's plan. God's plan was perfect love. He created the whole universe and He made you for a relationship with Him, but something went wrong. We all ran away from God in our own ways. It's called sin. And sin is anything from lying to murder. And it leaves us separated from God in brokenness. It kind of feels like we've got this God-shaped hole in our heart that we try to fill with other things like drugs and alcohol, unhealthy relationships, and even success. We think, if I just have enough money, then I'll be happy. But you know how the saying goes, money can't buy your happiness. And all of these things are like bungee cords. They snap us back into brokenness and we can't get out on our own. But God loves us so much and He didn't want us to stay in brokenness forever. So He sent His Son, Jesus. Jesus came, He was fully God, fully man. He lived a perfect life. Then He died a sinner's death on the cross. He died the death that we deserved. Then three days later, He rose again, victorious over sin, so that if any of us would choose to turn from sin and brokenness, living an empty way of life, believe in Jesus and make Him the Lord of our life, then we can be forgiven and restored back into God's perfect plan for our life and back into the loving relationship with God that He always intended for us to have. The Bible says that He then makes us into brand new creations. He heals us and sets us free from anything that might have held us bound before. Now I want to ask you a question. Which circle do you feel like you're in right now? Brokenness or God's perfect plan? Which circle do you want to be in? I would say that pretty much everybody wants to be over here. And finally, is there anything stopping you from turning from sin and living an empty way of life? believing in Jesus, following Him, making Him the Lord of your life so that you can receive forgiveness and be restored back into relationship with God today. If you'd like to get out of brokenness and into God's plan for your life today, why don't you pray this simple prayer with me? Dear Jesus, I believe that you died on the cross for my sin and that you rose again on the third day so that I can be free. I'm sorry that I sinned and that I went my own way, but today I choose to make you the Lord of my life. Thank you for forgiving me and making me a brand new creation. Fill me with your Holy Spirit and lead me in righteousness and truth. Amen. If you've just prayed that prayer, I want to say welcome to the family because Jesus said anyone who believes Him and who receives Him as Lord and Saviour, He gives the right to become children of God. So we're a family and we'd love to connect with you and help you grow in your relationship with God. Click the button below and fill out your contact information so that we can get in contact with you. Finally, I want to pray this quick prayer for you. May the God of all hope fill you with peace and joy so that by the power of the Holy Spirit, you may abound in hope. In Jesus' name, amen.